Good morning, sunflowers. Welcome back to my channel. It is my last day of school ever. How are we here? It is Thursday, May 4th when I'm filming this. Stormy is perked up in bed with me. We have my last day of class literally ever. This is just like so insane. If you're new here, hi, my name is Grace. I'm a senior at the University of Missouri. I'm about to graduate and move into my new apartment in literally like less than two weeks now. It's happening so, so, so fast. Everything is so crazy. But today's gonna be a busy one. I'm teaching my last cycling class ever right stormy i'm going to my last like in-person class it's my video i already gave my presentation and my final presentation on tuesday i think it went well it doesn't really grade very strict so to be honest i didn't like put my all into it but you know we did what we could and so i just have to like listen to other people's presentations today and then i need to like finish my bio assignments and things like that and then i also thought it'd be fun if besides the final class and final cycling maybe we can walk around campus a little bit and i'll show you show you some spots just like have a fun little last day of school wouldn't that be fun you notice that like dot in my bed i still have specs all over my apartment from hosting my besties abby's 21st shot party if y'all saw that weekend in my live vlog so if you noticed this throughout the video that's what that is but we're gonna get up it's currently 8 20 i've been awake since 7 30 but i was gonna start my day with doing like work in my bed but we gotta get today going it's gonna be a good one literally i'm never gonna go to an in-person class again this is so insane all right we need to get our day going this is crazy all right first up of course we need our morning coffee as we have started all of our school vlogs i have like every taylor swift song ever stuck in my head just because i feel like this is such like a dramatic phase of life i'm in right now so we love that All right, y'all, we have our morning coffee. My at-home coffees with my espresso machine are just like literally so good. I'm so picky with this stuff. Like whenever I'm home, I go get coffee out every single day because I don't have my machine with me whenever I visit my parents. And every time I'm back at school, I'm like, no need for a drive through This stuff is so good. But we're gonna get started with our day. I'm gonna get things moving. I, I usually literally have like pretty chill mornings on school days because I try to have like work days on my non-school days because I've had class this semester just Tuesday, Thursdays. And Tuesday, Thursdays are just school, so I usually have slower times. But obviously, it's my last day of school ever, so I want to make kind of a decent amount of content today. So, that's what we're going to do. I need to get started with making my bed because I'm going to be making like a first day of school get ready with me for TikTok. And I don't want the background to be dusty, not like my snacks and my water and Stormy's hammock. It's just, we've been getting by. The end of the semester has just been us getting by. We'll update, talk about that today, but like I literally have just been like a million directions, but everything's wrapping up. So let's make my bed. All right, y'all, bed is made for the day. Sorry, my towel, like everything in here, I'm about to move. So if anyone else gets in the state before moving, where it's literally like I'm kind of just existing in a mess because I know I'm about to pack up anyways. That's just like the kind of state that I get into. But I need to set my tripod up because I'm going to do a little makeup get ready with me for my last day of school ever. We have to romanticize the day, of course. So love, love this. We're going to set this up. A little just life update. I feel like last time I talked to y'all. I was very stressed because I was trying to get all my hours for my intern class. Oh, I need to me in. But I officially finished that, so that's really good. However, with that, I was doing so many hours that I got behind on, like, every other kind of work I have. School, YouTube, everything. So, I'm officially back just because I had to get the hours for this class while trying to, like, handle everything else. Yeah, that is how life has been. But that's finally done, so I'm kind of just playing catch up on like every other area of my life right now. It's May 4th right now. I move into my new apartment on the 13th. I also graduate college on the 13th. That day is going to be crazy. I officially got a subway sir, so I don't have to pay double rent this summer, which is pretty much the best thing ever because I was a little financially stressed about that. Um, I feel like I got some questions about that. People just being like, why are you doing that? I think that everyone needs to do what's best for them and what's best for me was getting my own space right after college. I know I wouldn't be staying in my college town because of work and other things, and I was ready for the next chapter, but I also knew just for me personally, the situation I was in, I decided it'd be best to get an apartment instead of move back home. But I am literally moving like 
30 minutes from my parents and I'm going to be seeing them all the time and like my siblings and stuff which I'm literally so excited about and that was like such a big factor in choosing to live there so I'm really excited to get close to my family but I just didn't want to like move back in with my family if I had the um situation where I could get a place especially because I do all this stuff so living on my own for all this just makes it a little easier but yes all right let's get ready for school I'm so excited I'm gonna do makeup and hair I think because it's last day like we just have to romanticize it <laughs> Okay, I just filmed my TikToks, so I'm going to go ahead and quick edit them, and then I'm going to do my hair and get dressed for the day. So I'll catch up with you guys after I do that. I usually only do my makeup for the Get Ready With Me's. I feel like I'm not that good at hair, so like no one wants a tutorial of that for me. But yeah, I'm going to edit these, and then I'll check in with y'all. All right, y'all, so I am ready for class. Here's a little last class of OOTD ever. So crazy. But I'm wearing this Amanda Upper Richard dress. Very extra, I know, but I'm going to be taking pictures and like content and stuff today for the last day of school so i've always been a little overdressed so i'm just you know really doing it for the end my little golden goose dupes kind of dress it down stony clover backpack my hair is up because it really needs a wash day but this week's been chaotic so it just has not happened but yeah i'm gonna grab my water bottle head to class this is the fit let's go watch some presentations and never be in a classroom again after this All right, besties, so a little check-in. Sorry, the lighting's a little harsh. This was like a little quiet area of campus. So I wanna do catch y'all up here. I finished my last class ever. I was literally just listening to other people's presentations because I already went. So it was super easy and simple. So got that done for the day. And now I need to go pick up something from the student center. I think I might get food there one last time just to like reminisce. I well, didn't go here as a freshman, so I never like ate in the dining halls a lot. But my first like year of going here, I used to eat lunch on campus like at least once a week so i'm gonna do that and then i'm gonna go take pictures by the columns so i'll kind of show you guys some parts of campus that, like i spend a lot of time on and stuff but yeah we're here right now I'm gonna head over it's 12 46 we're having a fun little last day just like romanticizing it so yeah we're sitting right by this building over here is where i had like maybe one fourth of my in-person classes i only had classes in like a few different buildings this is the arts and science building right here so i spent a lot of time over here and then like right diagonal is the class i just came from so i was like really all very close to like the downtown part of campus if you go to mizzou but all right let's go to the student center <laughs> all right yeah i'm having my last little lunch bye the student center. Somebody bought my lunch. That was like the nicest little goodie ever. I got um, mangoes and orange chicken. I'll also show y'all what I got at the student store. But just like pay it forward because that little nice thing just like made my whole day. Free lunch. Like what? Okay, but I came here because I need to go to the Mizzou store. I got an email that I get this for free. I wasn't originally going to buy anything like I said in that like boa video, but I got an honors medallion free. And then like she awkwardly was like, do you want the cord? And I thought it was free too, so I ended up paying for the court. But I also have an honors court, so apparently I did do school sometimes. But I'm gonna eat my lunch and enjoy my last little time out here. But yeah, that was just such good vibes. My little last time eating at the student union, someone got my food. Such a good day. All right, y'all, I'm walking by all the big spots on campus. Here's the old Missouri fountain, the water is super loud. But I think I might try and take some pictures here and see how they turn out. This building right here is where I had my child come class, which was my favorite class I took in all of college. It says high school on it, but it is a college classroom. All right, y'all, I just got home. Look how cute. This is what I come home to from school every day, and this is why I like working from home, because she's literally the cutest thing ever. Yes. Hi, baby. Stormy was definitely one of my best choices of college, getting a cat in college. 
All right, y'all, I just got home. I am proudly wearing my medallion, but I wanted to show you guys. For the sake of the vlog, Maria is here. <laughs> okay, I got my little medallion. Look how exciting. I feel really drama about this. Feeling amazed. We have the cord. I accidentally got duped into purchasing, but I guess we should celebrate that my grades were better than expected. So, yay, I'm gonna put this stuff up and I need to do some homework now because I still have online classes to do. I don't know if those are actually gonna get done today, but no matter what, this is technically still the last day of school. So I'm never gonna be like on campus for all this stuff again. I need to get ready to teach spin in like a few hours. So we're gonna see how much bio I can do in that time. in their last bio assignment me and I'm pretty sure as long as I calculated correctly even if I got a zero I would pass the class I had to do like two final discussion posts so it took me like over an hour and I hate doing those so much and that's been the one thing this semester that I've been like I don't want to graduate like I'll miss college so much but bio made me be like no I actually won't miss college like I hate doing this this is not for me so we are feeling really really good about that it is currently 434 so I need to go to dress teach spin my last cycling class ever at the rec which is literally crazy i don't really have post-grad like plans about cycles set in mind right now so it's pretty scenty because even though there's a good chance i would love to find a studio to teach at probably not the girls are going crazy i'm just gonna put them in frame because they're being so funny but um even though i would love to find a studio to teach at after school in st louis we'll see if that happens and either way whether i do that or not i want to give myself some time to adjust to my post-grad life schedule, like work and YouTube and everything, just like not being a student because I'm so used to being a student and having things around my school schedule. So either way, I'm gonna be taking quite a break from cycle, um, hopefully not forever. I really hope that I teach in a studio someday, but either way, this is my last class in the layer and I love teaching in the layer so much. I've never showed it that much on my channel before. I'm gonna get some clips today, but it's such a fun atmosphere. It's like black light so everything looks super cool i wear black clothes but like if i have like white socks on or like sometimes if i have like my nails done they'll glow because of the black lights super cool paintings and i just i love teaching there so 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 much it's been such a big part of my journey here at mizzou i feel like it brought me so many friendships and also sorry it's being funny she's she's interested in what we have to say right so yes you are uh it just brought me so much confidence and i feel like my public speaking skills are not honestly thanks to my classes here at mizzou they're thanks to being a cycle instructor at the rec so the girls are so funny i'm gonna go get dressed though tried to give that little scenty speech because this has like honestly been the thing i've been the most involved in at mizzou and i'm definitely going to miss it all right y'all sorry for the back little lighting but i am dressed for my last cycle class ever i'm wearing these black shorts i'm kind of wearing it like make it look like a dupe of the free people romper this little tiger x um work tank top just tucked into it super duper cute and i'm gonna throw my hokas on i'm just gonna leave my pigtails in and honestly i usually leave my makeup on for classes and just clean my face and do like a full shower afterwards so yeah let's go teach my last cycling class ever <laughs> I just got to class. This is the studio. I'm about to cue the music up and I go to the door and I basically just check everybody in, teach the class, and then just thank everyone on the way out. So let's do it. Hey guys, so I am home from my last cycle class ever, which seems so, so, so crazy. I literally just body showered, ordered pizza, and threw comfy clothes on. But I wanted to come on and end this vlog. I can't believe this is my official last college day of my life ever. I've made so many of these on my channel. I've been vlogging my daily college life since I was a freshman, the day of my life, some week in my life, and all sorts of fun content. And we're wrapping up that chapter. I'm still gonna have a graduation vlog and some end of the semester things. Um, I'll definitely be filming. But yeah, today was my last day of college, which is crazy. So thank y'all so much for being part of this journey. And I can't wait to bring you on my postgrad journey. And y'all are gonna really love it. We're gonna have work weeks in my life and moving into my new apartment and organizing vlogs and shopping vlogs and so 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 much stuff so yeah from the bottom of my heart thank you for watching all of my college vlogs and i hope you decide to stick around 
and watch all the vlogs to come. You guys mean so much to me and you have been my best friends in college and through all of my lonely periods of college, y'all were always here. So yeah, I love you so much. I'll see you somewhere else on the internet or in my next video.